Yes, students will head back to South Florida schools in the fall if there is a COVID-19 vaccine or not. Administrators are furiously working to finalize their plans. Local 10 News reporter Hansel Vela continues our live team coverage now with that. Hansel. Kevin, just really the beginning of the conversation of what the classroom here in Broward will look like come August 19th. In preliminary conversations, the school board is weighing several options. Based on staff recommendations, the hybrid staggered day model seems to be the most popular. Sometimes we call a blended model, uh, which effectively consists of staggered days, where students are going to school a portion of the time um, on campus and the other portion they're going at home. This model, which right now is just an initial idea, was formulated based on research, what other school districts are doing across the country, and feedback from teachers and parents. Here are two slides the school board shared, which show a majority of parents and teachers want either the hybrid model or fully reopening schools. You've got people that want to physically go in, and you've got parents that don't want their kids to go in, and we should be able to accommodate that. If you're a parent concerned about COVID and want your kid to stay home, there's a solution. We will always have the e-learning, distance learning as a continued option. Runcy says the school board wants students to get at least 50% of their learning in a classroom setting. The superintendent also vowing to bring back athletics and other school activities by mid-July. And again, this is just the beginning of the conversation because we're not expected to see a final decision until late July, early August. Now, let's also talk about a different story that we've been following all day today. Let's take you to some video here because we are we have been able to confirm that a private school in Davie, a staff member tested positive. Again, we're confirming that a staff member has tested positive for COVID at the preschool of the David Posnick Jewish Community Center. Staff says they found out yesterday the health department is in touch with the families of the eight children who were in contact with the employee. Those children will be tested and remain in quarantine at least until June 24th. We continue to follow that story. We have more details for you at 11. For now, reporting live in Fort Lauderdale, I'm Hatsovella, Local 10 News.